Hey guys, I am filming a what is in my travel makeup bag today because I am going to New York soon. Actually though, as we're filming this, it is the day before Christmas Eve and I know that seems way back in last year. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm having to film January's videos before January because I'm going to New York and then I'm away for the rest of January so anyway my point being was I've actually packed a travel makeup bag to take back to Sheffield with me for Christmas but this is what I will be taking to New York and it is what I would take on holiday and stuff so I thought I would just show you because it seemed an appropriate time being as I'm going to New York on the 8th of January I booked me and my mum a trip because I don't know just wanted to go <laughs> YOLO 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 So first of all my makeup bag is from Topshop and it's actually meant to be a clutch bag It's got white sequins on that shine like green and pink in the light They're like holographic, they're amazing I love this makeup bag so much, it's a perfect size and it's just so pretty it Reminds me of unicorns Can't remember how much it was but it wasn't that much money Anyway I'm going to show you the brushes that I take first so I always make sure to take two foundation brushes. Whenever I go anywhere, by the way, I take my brush cleaner as well because I just can't stand having dirty brushes. So that is why I don't pack a ton of brushes because I clean them when I'm there. But I've just got a flat top brush from eBay and then I've got this Expert Face Brush by Real Techniques, which I'm really liking right now. I didn't used to like it, I thought it was too small, but now it's so good. Then I take my Real Techniques blush brush for contour and blush. I take the Real Techniques cheek brush. I use this a lot for contour actually and blush as well. Depends which I'm feeling on the day. And then I take a few eye brushes. So I take my MAC 266 which is just an angled brush for brows. And then I go ahead and take the Real Techniques angled shadow brush and this Fanfare, no Fanatic E1. Don't know what the deal with this is. Zoe gave it me when I went to her house, so yeah, it's a really good brush for packing shadow on. Moving on to actual makeup, the first thing I take is my Body Shop Insta Blur, and I'm not going to talk about this a lot, just the best primer ever. I'm going to try and go in order of how I put my makeup on, so the next thing I take is foundation. I actually take a couple of shades, just in case I fake tan, but this is my favourite foundation, and it's the MAC Studio Fix. And the other shade that I will be taking is the YSL Touche Clap. I'll just mix these two if I am fake tanned, or just use this on its own, but then I've got one medium coverage and one full coverage just in case. Then the next thing I take is my Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. This is my favourite concealer. I've got it on now. I wear it all the time. It's just perfect for under the eyes. Onto face products. I am taking my Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess bronzer. I love this because it's huge and it's got a huge mirror. So if I'm doing makeup on the go, it's just really good, like on, on a train or something. Then I'm taking my MAC Modesty Blush. And this is a new product in my life. I bought it like last week, but it's the most perfect blush shade it's like a muted dusty rose love it next for cheeks I'm taking my NARS Copacabana Illuminator this is the best highlighter ever I keep talking about this so I'm not going to talk about it too much but I am in love with this honestly it's incredible next up is powder and I'm just taking my MAC Studio Fix on to eyes there are three products that I'm taking for eyes and the first one is the Naked Basics palette and I love this. I actually use this for my brows. I mix the darkest two shades together to fill my brows in, which is what I've done today, just in case you wondered what I've got on my brows. And then I just use the rest of the palette for eyeshadow. I'm in love with this palette. It's so good. And the next two eye products I take are my Benefit Their Real Mascara and my YSL Ball Slash Effects. I think that's what it's called. I take these two because I like them as a mix together but I also really like them on their own and it honestly depends what eyeshadow I wear as to which mascara I like to wear. If I'm wearing a heavier eye I like to wear this because it's more volumizing but if I'm wearing just a lighter eye like today I like to wear the Benefit Their Real. Oh no I've got one more eye product and it is Max Painterly Paint Pot just to prime them and that is all I've got on my eyes today and then I've got four lip products. So the first one is Max Modesty Lipstick this is just a really pretty brownie nude shade and it's a cream sheen so it's super moisturising. Then I've got my Soap and Glory Sexy Mother Pucker Lip Gloss Stick. Now I love this, they're kind of the same shade but this one's a little bit more brownie. I love this if I just want an easy lip to put on that I know I can just throw on and it'll look fine because it's not too pigmented. Then I am taking my Dior Lip Maximizer Collagen Active. 
This is incredible. It makes my lips look huge. I'm going to put some on now, actually. This is my favourite lip gloss ever. I wear it over the top of basically every lipstick just to add a bit of kissableness. And then, of course, I'm taking my Kiko Lip Precision Lip Pencil. And that is everything that I'm taking in my makeup bag. It's now completely empty. I will actually probably take a red lipstick as well. Let me go get one. And this is Max Diva. It's my favourite darker lipstick. It's a matte kind of red wine colour. It's just so, so pretty. Love it so much. If you're looking for a more true red, because this is quite whiny, then Max Russian Red is incredible, but I really like the darker ones. So that is everything in my makeup bag. Let me know what you take in your travel makeup bag. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and let me know in the comments what your favourite lipstick shade is. Subscribe if you'd like to see more of me, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Bye, 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 bye. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> yeah. Bye. <laughs> Oh my god, guys, I've got my cupcake top on, but then I've got onesie bottoms on. How funny is that? Ah! Hey guys, I've got my 2014 favourites yet, and I'm going to do what every girl's going to say right now, and say, holy crap, where the hell did 2014 go? Like, seriously, 